Like everything is new in this unit. Ooh, Caesar's Palace. That could be a vintage shirt. We found some stuff earlier that said Elvis Presley, so I'm assuming this EP is going to be Elvis Presley again. Mm, let's see if his assumption is correct. Oh, bam! Here we are. I'm Jones. Thrown into the mix. What do we have here? An Elvis t shirt. Is that a single stitch by chance? It, all right, what's in this tub? What's it? Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Box hands. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa. Wait. So we just bought another storage unit here at this storage auction that was live. You probably saw some of the footage, but we're going to get into this storage unit so you can see exactly what we got. Um, you saw it was a bunch of boxes. So let's get into them. What does that one say? This one says, storage, Elvis plate, Elvis collection, Ooh. or collect. So let's see what we got. All right. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Look at that. That That's looks nice. nice. Yes. Elvis. And it's Elvis. got something in it. Elvis. It's got something in it. I think it's money. Blue suede shoes? Or money? Oh. Uh, let's see. What do we have? This is clear vinyl shower curtain. <laughs> <laughs> wow. This is quite the Elvis collection here. This is... Look Good golly. at this plate here. Oh, it's two of them. Okay. That's pretty cool. Ooh, there's a neon telephone. Sorry, I'm looking ahead. <laughs> you got the Elvis clock. Clock. There's a singing and dancing telephone. Wow. And it looks to be in here. Yeah, I wouldn't pull that out. <laughs> What else do we have? We've or pull it out. <laughs> catalogs, Ooh. newspaper clippings. We'll we have look at the some dates on new those. VHS tapes that are unopened, unopened DVD, a book, TV Guide. Wow. What year is that? The TV Guide years are usually on the inside. Well, we'll find it later. And here's another telephone, Neon. Nice. A clock. Another clock. Another clock and a little glass plate. Yes. Kind of, kind of thing. Well, I wonder what else we can find because we already saw one box of Elvis ceramic figures. So now we have a whole box of Elvis stuff. What else will we find? It's so dark in there. <laughs> Thankfully, we're right by this door, the outside door, that gives us some natural light into the hallway. And, of course, they have the lights above, but there's no lights in the unit. He's digging. He's digging for a good one. Yeah, because a lot of this is going to be closed. So, you never know what you find in the clothes. Wow, it said scarves and gloves, and they were right. They're brand new. So much stuff in this unit is brand new. Awesome. We like new. What's in this one? Ooh. Shake it. Shake it. We've got... Oh. Kids clothes. Kids clothes. Interesting. Hats, scarves, sweaters. Yep, sweaters. Clothes. And because it's vintage, we may end up finding. Who knows what we'll find vintage-wise? Says towels. like towels. Yep. Okay. 
So this one says purses. So when I could see without even opening it, there was purses in there. So. All right. This is where we keep the money. This is exactly where we keep the money. And we have purses stuff loaded in the with... purse. <laughs> nice. Which means we could potentially find... What, what do you find at the bottom of purses, Lisa? Change. Change and... Ch -ch -ch change Coin, money, moolah. So we'll have to go through this with a finer tooth comb. Because we're not going to pull out all the personal paperwork in here. Yeah. But... But what do we got? We got more purses. More purses. Ooh, wow. Well, as clean as it looks. This one says baby clothes, so... <laughs> Just open it, because we don't know what kind of... Like, we don't know. That one said... It feels like... All right, ready? More clothes. Hangers, tags. Like everything is new in this unit. Ooh, Caesar's Palace. That could be a vintage shirt. That it could be. I Two mean, of them. Nice. These are look brand new like they weren't even worn. I don't see a tag on them, but these are extra large. But those are in very good condition. Route 66. Get your kicks. So I think there's going to be more clothes like this in there, too. Yeah, for sure. We got sweaters. Look at that. Oh, that's really pretty. It's and a cardigan. 100% acrylic. That's not the brand. <laughs> I didn't say that was the brand. Unless it is the brand. I was looking to see if it was wool. I know. So. I don't really see in here, but just sweaters. Yep, sweaters. Okay. Knitted blankets. All right, so we're back here at this unit. You can see we got all the clothes out that were on the hangers, the rack right here. We'll show that to you in a minute. It's in our ca uh, camper <laughs> trailer. So now we're going to get through all of these boxes. What is in all of these boxes? More clothes, shoes. What else are we gonna find? Let's get to it. And we're gonna work out here on this table because it's dark in there. So we're gonna come out here and pull boxes out here and see what we can find. This one says clothes and diaper bags. So, is it clothes and diaper bags? Well, it's definitely bags. New and packaged diaper bag. Okay. Diaper bag. Diaper These bag. These are in package, but they still have the tags on them. And we got some clothes down there. Yes, we do. Okay. Some clothes have tags. This one says Pillow shams, blankets. Well, let's see how accurate they are. Dun dun dun. Well, we have, what is this? Looks like a, another tote bag. It's a bag of some sort. It's brand, oh, it's a backpack. There we go. Nice. Lily and Vernon. Oh, wow. Lily and Vernon. Shams. We have, uh, more Lily and Vernon. And we have, this looks like a blanket. Leopard. Cat quilt. It's not focusing. Leopard cat quilt, full size. And there's the cats. That looks very cute. Nice, brand new. The next box is coming out. So we found some stuff earlier that said Elvis Presley. So I'm assuming this EP is gonna be Elvis Presley again. Mm, let's see if his assumption is correct. Oh, bam! Here we are. <laughs> Elvis Presley Boulevard. We got a whole 1978 big... color calendars, news articles. Wow. 
And this stuff is old vintage stuff. What are the years on those catalogs or the year on magazines? This? 87. 87. Yes. Wow. Very nice. Yeah. Little Tom Jones. Thrown into the mix. What do we have here? An Elvis t-shirt. Is that a single stitch by chance? It is a single <laughs> stitch. Wow. Look at that. All right, so we got more t-shirts here. Are all of these? This is single stitch as well. Wow. Look at that, that is definitely a vintage tag for Hanes. Yep. And there are ways to look up if there's not a year on there. Let me see. I'm going to zoom in there. Is there a year? 1977. Wow, look at these old t-shirts. Wow. How many are in there? One, two, three. So that's two, three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven. That's eight t-shirts. Wow. wow. Now we don't know if these have any value yet, but um, well, we... Well, we definitely know it's Elvis, so that's a start. <laughs> and it's vintage, and it's single stitch, so we're hoping that <laughs> Look at this. oh and here's the the trucker cap collection they still have the nice little hooks on them haven't been worn wow. three of those are those snapback they're snapback and we get this let's see oh wow so here's elvis post-it stamp Ooh, they're probably they're just all different same. colors yeah wow Nice. Very nice. Now, I'm wondering what's in here. Mm. We're getting there. Tiny little Elvis collectibles that need to be contained in a box. <laughs> what's that? That says O'Neill's. This is... Is that like a bracelet? It looks like a bracelet. I wonder if it's silver. I don't know. Or maybe it's white gold. Ooh, that'd be even better. <laughs> No, no markings. No markings. Okay. <laughs> An Elvis pen. Here's a nice little Elvis ornament. We oh, might have to. And some shot glasses. There's three of them in there. Okay. There's a glare from that door. We might have to close that door. There's a tin. Is something in there. <laughs> this looks like one of those old school frisbees, but yeah, there we go. <laughs> All right, let's let's see what's in here. What is? Oh, the Whoa. stamps. What are what year are those from? This is first day of issue. January eighth, nineteen ninety three. Okay, ninety three. Guess what? I was in eighth grade. <laughs> Now, y'all know how old he is, if you can do your math. <laughs> well, here's the interesting thing. My birthday is January 8th. Who do that, uh, Wait, do that why, why is that significant? Who else's birthday is January 8th? Oh! It's the king. Oh, Roy shares a birthday with the king. All right, what's in this tub? What's in Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, let's see. Let's see what we have in here. Lots of goodies. Here's another one of those little record oh, things. Oh, that's on a keychain, though. What's that? What is it? Gold. Oh. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Don't be cruel. King of rock. Just Look at give that. me some gold. <laughs> <laughs> This that was the a... worst Elvis impersonation ever. Yes, it was. <laughs> I'm pretty sure old. that one's not gold. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not. But it's the shiniest gold I've ever did it's see. It's got a little bit of weight, and that these are two nice pieces. Let's go ahead and put those back. And what do we have in here? Gold. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wrong way. Wow, look at this. I wonder if this is a medallion and it just broke here off the top. Um, here's another Elvis Presley, King of Rock and Roll. 
So another little necklace here. I don't think this is gold. But this is more like a little locket, locket charm for your wrist. So, um, what else do we have? Also known as a bracelet. <laughs> Look at that. Wow, what is that little spinning doohickey? <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a nice little piece there. And actually, here's another one. So, that one looks like it's like a little keychain or something. Yep, those old school keychains. And this looks like it's a necklace, a little charm. Same scenario, just this one's on a necklace, and I don't see any markings, but doesn't mean that it won't sell. Here's your bracelet. Wow, got a whole set, matching set here. <laughs> and here's another one of those Chain. keychains. Okay. Yeah. Pins down in there. I see a spoon, playing cards, more keychains, oh, yeah. an ashtray, buttons. buttons. Oh, that's a, one of those a little, little spinny things on a stand. Yeah. Pins, there's that ashtray. Yep, these are playing cards. Oh, another pack of cards, belt buckle. Oh my gosh, wow. there's like everything <laughs> you can imagine matches, bottle opener. Bing. A mirror. Wow. Oh, yeah. Crazy. Oh, and then here's a spoon still in the box. It's two of them. Okay. What's he going to pull out with next? Or what's he going to come out with next? We closed that door because there was such a glare from outside. It was hard to focus in on the, the goods. There we go. What do we got? Got another box. Holy. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. Whoa, we got a Beatles t shirt. Look at this. It's not, not single, single stitch. stitch. Whoa, whoa. It still has the tags, and the tag on the top said made exclusively for Bloomingdale's. Bloomingdale's. There wow. We Do we got a date on that anywhere? Do we have a date on it? Uh, I'm just going to show this tag, tag here. 2000. Made exclusively for Bloomingdale's. Okay. Interesting. Right down here. All right. Oh, like it's even, it's even like fabric on there. Fabric on there. I don't know if that's the right word, but that's cool. That's a good find. Yes, it is. So we had a lot of clothes to sift through, but there are definitely um, vintage God Bless America shirts. Nice. Yes. And Those are nice. Single stitch? Yep. Cool. Those are like white, white, never been worn white t-shirts. <laughs> white is not my favorite color of t-shirt. So... We got some sweaters, we got the shirts. So the interesting thing Lisa said yesterday to me was she's hoping that we find the accessories specifically that go with the clothes. So we're on the hunt. What do specifically women mostly, in this case this was a woman, um, you know, when you buy lots of clothes, what do you also buy to go with it? Jewelry. Let us know in the comments. What do you guys think? All right, let's see what's in this one. Can we find the jewelry? Hopefully not tutti frutti's. <laughs> or the malt meal hot cereal breakfast. But we're looking at bags to start off with and more new with tags. Look at that, Silent Night Christmas. Aw, how cute. Lots of Christmas sweaters. <laughs> Lots of Christmas sweaters, yes. Like all the same. <laughs> Several of them. With tags. So this is a box of sweaters, and they all appear to have tags on them. Yes, they do. Crazy. This one says winter jackets and chair pads. Hmm. Okay. 
Let's see. Well, there's a winter jacket. There is a winter jacket, and it is dirty. It's got some burn marks in it. Mm. We definitely haven't smelled smoke yet here. No, we haven't. And here are your There's chair your pads. chair pads. <laughs> this one says totes in storage. Ooh, intriguing. What kind of totes do we have? It looks like bags. Aww, you know how I love my bags. This Any... one has a hard bottom. Anything that I would like? I don't know. <laughs> Victoria's Secret. Okay. That's this pink one here. Oh, okay. It's very tiny, tiny little bag. That's because it's a secret. <laughs> what might be hidden? What are these? Elite Shoppers Hotline. Wow. This is old. Scandinavian health spas. Wow. That is from, that is definitely from <laughs> years ago. And I'm just looking to make sure there isn't anything personal in here. I wonder if that was... Did you all have Scandinavian health spots where you were? Or was that more... Um, Look at that. Cards. Mother's Day cards. Or was that just a local thing here in the Cleveland area? Let us know in the comments. We got some maps here. Ooh, I love maps. Ooh, what are these? Thank you and best wishes from Brown and Bigelow. Interesting. Mm -hmm. So That's kind of the first, like, personal stuff we found, isn't it? Yeah. And we Ooh, have a Caesars. Oh, that's nice. A tote bag. Um, we found a couple of Caesars Palace t-shirts already. Mm -hmm. Baby bags. And this is a carrier seat cover. This stuff yeah. is so, like, <laughs> even the patterns of things are just so vintage. Oh, yeah. Whoa, he pulled out this giant rolling tote thing. It still has a price tag on it. Bovano. Yeah. But it's filled. What is in this thing? I'm going to guess. Close. Close. <laughs> no. Ooh. What do we got? I'm waiting to see an expression. Oh, hello. Hello. Hello there. Plush pals. And this is filled with. Want to put it on the ground so I can get a better angle since I'm short <laughs> and it's tall. Ooh, look at all them. There's a little set Just of. Loaded. Oh, get the Guess How Much I Love You books with the little bunnies, Mama and Baby. Sweet. We got a little set of three bears there. We got a snowman. <laughs> don't like the S word. <laughs> yeah, I we probably don't have to pull out all no, of them. Oh my gosh. Is... This vintage plush is really fun to look through too. We've yeah. done well with vintage plush. We got so, a bunch of it out of another unit a couple years ago. What kind of shoes we have in here? I'm a little nervous, to be honest. Okay. <laughs> White stag. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at those, though. <laughs> Sun and moon slippers. Look at these funky things. <laughs> okay. These still have Little a tag on. Moccasin slippers. Do those say leather? Yes, they do. Genuine leather. Nice. So, Expressions Footwear for Women. Brand new. Still with the tag. This is Eight probably and a half. all brand new. Probably. What's this? Walkables. Still has the tag on it. Wow. I don't know how in style some of these sandals will be. So. You know, like with a lot of the clothes, these will be in the dollar sale. But, like, look at these. Heck, I might keep these for myself because it's just a pair of flip-flops. And they're my size. All right. We'll put those aside. <laughs> so, yeah, we have shoes all the way to the bottom. I got. I see a 
pair of silver moon boots down there. See, now that one's a size 10 in your hand there. Those are boots. Size 10. They Looks don't... like they were brand new. We're going to have to probably put some of this Same stuff aside. With these. Look at this. Brand Still brand has new. the tag on them. What size are those? These are a size... I can't see on the box. Hold on, let me just pull the box out. I just can't see. Well, let me pull it out. Nine. Oh, there it is. I was looking here, and it was right there. So we have a size 8, 9, and 10, which is weird. So, again, we don't know if this was a hoarder scenario where this person well, well, was just buying, buying, buying well, to buy. Here was She was a buyer for her job of clothes. Nice tops and sweats. <laughs> Let's see. If they're nice, if we agree with what nice means. Through to the loom. But this is definitely, this is from 1997. Wow. This is EBR. So, again, more clothes, new with tags. What is this? Ooh. I wonder if Christy's Looks like watching. a velour tracksuit. I wonder if Christy's watching. <laughs> we gave her one of our, one of the sets yesterday when we visited them at the yard sale this is actually um matching sets so that's and they have the tags on them so that is if anybody is interested in a burgundy velour tracksuit with a zip up hoodie size large size large let us know got some ribbing on those pants almost reminds me of corduroy but not yeah <clears throat> now here's the interesting thing for a lot of the boxes she actually marked the year now i'm not sure if that's the year she got the clothes or the year they came into storage or how that worked but this is 2006 so let's see what we have this one for 2006 we have some bobby brooks i can see right here on the top <laughs> who still makes clothes to this day. There's Again, there are the tags, um, sweaters, shirts. If you need some non-skid socks, we got some of those too. <laughs> we got it all. We got, it looks like pajamas. Yeah. Yes, they are. Little sleepy bears on them. Mm-hmm. And you can see we have some, what is this? T-shirts, like t -shirts. July t-shirts or something. Lifeguard. Independence Day Parade. I saw red, white, and blue in there too. Yeah, it's... Whoops. That one's still on the hanger. Mm. <laughs> oh, there's a Disney tag. The Wonderful World of Disney. What's that? What is that? There we go. Pants. Oh, we got the little true love down there on the leg. And then there's Minnie and Mickey. Yes, it is. Cute. And that's not an elastic waistband, so it's just the drawstring. It just looks like it might be. All right. Another box. This says Angel Dolls. Huh. Okay. That's different. Let's see. What kind of angel dolls are they? Because this is a light box. But there we are. Hmm. What is that? It's a different kind of angel doll. Bean Angel. Hmm. Another Bean Angel. Several of them. I don't know if there's any value to these, but we got several of them. That easy, but it's a beanie angel angel possibly here's a tote bag with some shoe 
boxes and Still got the tags on them. Brand new leather. Yep. Little moccasin shoes, slip ons. Brand new leather. What are these, Lise? They look like sandals of some sort. No. Hmm. But they aren't worn. They're not tied Those together. Look vintage. <laughs> yes, they do. Those look vintage. These smell vintage. Okay. <laughs> I didn't catch a whiff of those. Ooh, what are those? Islander. Those are cute flip flops. Size 8. That's my size. Let us know if you like something. Let us know if you like sparkles because we have sparkles. Ooh. <laughs> Silver slippers. Those look rough. Yeah, these were used. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So As well, the silver slippers, the sparkly slippers should have been. <laughs> Everybody needs a pair. But those haven't been used. Those are cute. Those are size eight and a half. What's that one? These look like some uh, walkables, but they have not been used. So. More angel dolls. Here's another box of these. There we are. Here's some purses. J, the letter J. And this still has its faded glory, still has a tag on it. This is, looks just like a, a bag. It looks like a bag? <laughs> yes, with uh, it's almost matching, different color. Looks like travel bags. There we go. More. Tote bag, Route 66. There's a handbag. Several wallets down here. Okay. All kinds of purses and bags and totes and makeup yes. bags. Nice. This one says Afghan Keep. I wonder if it's made, handmade. Or if it's even an afghan. <laughs> well, we'll find out. Because it looks like clothes. Yes, it does. It looks like pants to match a couple of those bags in that last box. Sweaters. Sweaters. I feel plastic down here, but there's no afghan in that. Here's some more new attack stuff. And All right. I don't see an afghan at the bottom of this, so it looks like... It's all clothes. Yep. Yep, all clothes. This was sitting on something, but I wasn't. Is that an Elvis rug? Let's see. It looks like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. It is an Elvis Presley rug. That it is. And it doesn't look like it's ever been used. Fun Rugs is the, the name brand. Wow. It's about a four by four by six. I would say four by five. Maybe three and a half by five. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And we got one more box to go. One more box. Last box. What do we Does have? Does that say underwear? Uh-oh. Might get a little ra Under X-rated. Uh -oh. <laughs> That does but not we start look like off underwear. with a luxury blanket, though. <clears throat> These blankets sometimes can be vintage and um, 
valuable depending on the maker and the design and things like that. So you always want to look the blankets up. What is, whoa, Ooh, what's that? What this. Whoa. That is a Star, Star Wars, Wars beach blanket. Beach blanket. From. Well, there's a big glare on that. 1977. Wow. That looks like it's still new in the package. Look at yeah, that. The package looks like it's from 1977. Rusty <laughs> package. That's cool. That could have some value. And you got some dainties down here. Yeah, there's the underwear. underwear underneath. <laughs> all right. And that's it. That's, that's all it. she wrote.